428 of 2013, 1613 hours. What I have done, I've left the core the same. I moved the rotor rollers to the outside. In fact, I only have the one on here. It's a one inch. I rigged this thing up. Enough it ought to hold together. A slow start showed a positive voltage. I've still got an oddball pink topped roller or yeah, magnet in there. Because there's an odd count, 47 I believe. But this is still with the new and improved uh, rotor in it. A copper band is just for measuring purposes. And I've got this thing awfully doggone close. I mean, this thing is... Yeah, it might be 10 millimeters. So... This thing had better cooperate. Come on, you. I've got to keep my feet out of the way again. Notice that thumping. It's that oddball. It turns, but it doesn't want to. field got off it's off center on the inside but not on the outside I get this no freaking dog on I can't see anything. glare so I'm running a vertical field on the outside 
and about a freaking 45, 60, a 70 degree twisted feel on the inside for some reason. Must be the twist in it. There's a way of getting around that. I know how, but that's a lot of work. So anyway, to prove my theory that running the field vertically would work, takes the load off of the... Oh crap, look at this thing. Oh, that's from scraping the wood. My brace. Well, this is just a general run anyway. This is just an experiment. Yeah, look how close that sucker is. I don't even think it's 10 millimeters. That eh, could be 10. But the, uh, Yeah, it takes the load by running the field vertically. I guess it could be straighter. And if you stand those magnets back up, that field's going to be tilted off to the left even more, which puts a load on the rotor, the rotor mags. So i got to do some tying down here. Put a balance weight on the other side. Those internal blocks just keep the thing from bending in and wobbling around. So I'm going to mess with this a little bit and see what I can come up with. But yeah, this is going to be about it. If I don't come up with something out of this, This will be my last one. As you can see, these are a lot better than the previous tilted ones. It took a long time to get these things like this. And they're not all perfect. And obviously I've got 47 of them in there. So, preliminary tests are positive. 